Welcome to the Golden State Warriors News Today channel. Take the opportunity to leave that like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go to today's news. The sharpshooter had just 15 points on 5-4-21 shooting against the Los Angeles Lakers on Saturday, but returned to form with 27 crucial points in a 135-126 win over the Washington Wizards. Now, Thompson prepares for something he hasn't done in nearly four years. The Warriors have been conservative with Thompson since his long-awaited return against the Cleveland Cavaliers on January 9 last year. Having come off an ACL and torn Achilles, he's yet to play in a back-to-back -back over the last 13 months. When asked if he'll play in Tuesday's matchup against the Clippers, Thompson answered, Yes, I'm so excited. When asked what it will mean to play in his first back-to-back -back since 2019, Thompson says he's honored to be able to do it in front of family. Tuesday's clash marks the Warriors' last game before the All-Star break, which might be behind the medical staff's decision to make Thompson available. Golden State will have nine days off before facing the Los Angeles Lakers on February 24. The reigning champions survived a 15-point first-half deficit and a late Wizards comeback to again move above .500 at 29-28. While they remain ninth in the Western Conference, there's still just three games separating the Phoenix Suns in fourth to the Oklahoma City Thunder in twelfth. The Clippers are part of that mix sitting sixth with a 31-28 record. They made some major moves in final hours before the trade deadline, sending out John Wall, Reggie Jackson, and Luke Kennard for Eric Gordon, Bones Highland and Mason Plumlee.